The 2014 cycling season got underway on the Geelong foreshore with some of the world's best in action. In the women's race, Peter Mullins got things off to an aggressive start, but her attempts to break away were brought under control by the Orica AIS team, who were riding in support of Olympic bronze medalist Annette Edmondson. At one lap to go, it was all set for a bunch sprint finish when Tiffany Cromwell launched an attack in her bid for victory. But it was Italy's Giorgia Bronzini, a dual road race world champion, who reeled her in to take the win ahead of Edmondson, with Cromwell having to settle for third. Yeah, for sure, for the new year, I start with the right foot and I hope to continue to ride that. We tried doing a bit of a lead out and got a bit messed up on the last corner. Tiff Cromwell attacked us on the inside and did a brilliant job, but um, yeah, now I'm very happy to come away with seconds. Still three more days to go. In the men's race, an early attack by Blair Windsor created the race winning breakaway, but the unfortunate Windsor crashed before the midway point and had to abandon. As the leading group of seven contested the sprint finish, there was the ever consistent Zach Dempster who got the win ahead of Great Britain's Felix English, with Brenton Jones in third and the Australian road champion Luke Durbridge fourth. Yeah, I couldn't be happier. I mean, January two, one win, that's really great. One more than last year, so even better. Stage two sees the Mitchelton Bay Cycling Classic move to Geelong's Eastern Park.